हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू अवर ऑनलाइन क्लास स्टैंडर्ड सेवन सब्जेक्ट साइंस लेसन नंबर फोर्टीन एलिमेंट्स कंपाउंड्स एंड मिक्सचर लेट्स रिकॉल व्हाट आर द डिफरेंट स्टेट्स ऑफ मैटर देर आर थ्री स्टेट्स ऑफ मैटर दैट इज सॉलिड लिक्विड एंड गैस The properties of matter include any traits that can be measured, such as an object, density, color, mass, volume, length, malleability, melting point, hardness, order, temperature, and more. Adding or removing energy from matter causes a physical change as matter move from one state to another. For example, adding thermal energy, that is heat, to liquid water, causing it to become steam. or vapor that is gas physical change can also be caused by motion and pressure all sample of a pure substance have the same chemical and physical properties for example pure copper is always its brown solid and always dissolve in a dilute nitric acid to produce a blue solution and brown gas physical property can be extensive or intensive matter anything that takes up space and has a mass matter we say that an object is made of a certain substance the term matter is also used as a synonym of substance in a scientific language however a single term is used for a single concept and that which an object is made of it's called as a matter different object are made up of matter that is they contain only one constituent the particulate nature of matter and properties of matter what are object made up of object are made up of substances or matter object object has mass this means the matter from which this object is made also has a mass object occupies space object acquire properties from the matter from which they are made they acquire both the properties from matter that they are made of in other word mass and volume are the two important properties of matter many kind of matter formed in nature are in pure form take a piece of chalk and keep on dividing it into smaller pieces what will happen when a chalk piece is divided into smaller and smaller pieces it ultimately turns into a powder form Wipe a drop of ink with a handkerchief. What effect does it have on the cloth of a handkerchief? The handkerchief absorbs the ink. Hence, there is a spot of ink seen on the handkerchief. What happens when the lid of a bottle of a perfume is opened? The fragrance of the perfume will spread everywhere. So, the matter may be in solid, liquid, or gaseous state, but their properties are due to the matter by which they are made. Example: Chalk is in solid form. ink is in liquid and perfume is in gaseous state the color of a chalk the blue color of ink the fragrance of a perfume are the properties of the matter which remain unchanged what is a substance the properties of matter depend on its maker some types of matter are substance and some are not a substance is a single kind of matter that is pure it also has a specific composition and a specific set of properties example is salt no matter where it comes from sea water or salt mine it always has the same composition and properties the kinds of matter contain only one constituent this are found in pure form in nature matter made of only one constituent is called substance example gold diamond water chalk mixture matter made up of two or more substances are called mixture a mixture is a substance made by combining two or more different material such a way that no chemical reaction occurs a mixture is an impure substance made up of two or more element physically combined together can be broken down by physical means no chemical changes take place substance held together by physical forces the properties of an element is a mixture remain same has no formula mixture form when two or more substances combine keep their physical properties 
can be separated by the physical properties and do not form a new substance. Atoms All substances are made of atoms. Water, hydrogen and oxygen atoms, plastic, carbon and hydrogen atoms, plant, carbon, nitrogen, hydrogen, oxygen and sulfur atoms. Take water in a teapot and cover it. Heat the water to a boil. What do you see on the inside of the lid? Fill water in a spray pump. Spray the water and observe the spray. The water droplets collected on the inside of the lid of a teapot are formed by the condensation of a vapor from the boiling point. Water in the form of vapor is composed of extremely tiny particles and therefore we cannot even see them. You will see that the spray is also composed of small particles of water. Since the water in the teapot is boiling, the steam will come out of it. The steam is gathered on the inner side of the lid. This again get condensed and form water droplets. When water is filled in the spray pump and spread, one can see mist of water draining very small water droplets. Similarly, all substances are made up of extremely tiny particles. The smallest particle of a substance are molecules. Substances whose molecules are made of one or more atoms which are exactly alike is called an element. We do not get different substances by the decomposition of an element. The smallest particles of element are made of only one type of atoms. We cannot see atoms with the naked eye. But when crores of atoms come together, the total volume is large enough to be visible to our eyes. The mass and volume of atoms of different elements are different. Element consists of unique type of atoms. Element cannot be further broken into simple substance by any chemical or physical means. There are 118 elements known. Each element is given a unique chemical symbol. Element are building blocks of matter. Scientists have discovered 118 elements. Of this, 92 elements occur in nature, while the remaining are man-made. Hydrogen, Oxygen, Nitrogen, Carbon, Iron, Mercury, Copper are a few of the important natural elements. More new elements are being discovered through research work. Great scientist Democrats named the small particles of element atom because in Greek language atomus means indivisible. In 1803, John Dalton proposed his theory stating that atoms cannot be created or divided into smaller particles or destroyed. He used certain symbol to represent elements. Oxygen occur in nature in a gaseous state. Two atoms of oxygen are joined to form a molecules of oxygen which has an independent existence. Oxygen in air is always into a molecular state. Just like atoms, molecules also cannot be seen with the naked eyes. A molecule is an electrical neutral group of atoms joined together by a chemical bond. A molecule may consist of two atoms of the same element or many atoms of a different element. In our next video, we are going to learn about metals, non-metals, metalloids, alloy, compound and separation of substances. Thank you.